Gee, that's a drill bit? Somebody call a doctor because bad medicine is back. That's right, we've got the answer. We've got Diamond Dave Damone, and you know you got Mason Quinn. Guys, this time we're going to be checking out Daniel Craig's fourth entry into playing James Bond. That's right, we're going to be taking a look at Spectre. Ooh. Now, I've seen it because I appreciate great cinema. Mm. These two guys have not. So, fellas, what are you expecting? I'm expecting a lot of action again, a lot of running and parkour action like the last three which i still can't wait to see because i'm expecting just a masterpiece as you claim it to be <laughs> and i'm hoping to see something shaken and not stirred <laughs> <laughs> fantastic i have high expectations after watching skyfall from here to a here now and plus our Good old pal Dave Batista's in it, so I have expectations, high ones for him as well. Let's get to it. <clears throat> All right, guys, you heard it here. Let's check out Spectre. Let's go! The dead are alive. Where are you going? I won't be long. <laughs> <laughs> Duty first. Is. Cufflinks. Cufflinks. Should I? Sì, è laggiù. Quando facciamo scoppiare lo stadio? Stasera alle 6. E poi che cosa succede? Io andrò dal re pallido. Oh, smoke. Ooh. <laughs> what the hell did he hit? The bombs in the briefcase? Is that what was in there? Uh, uh, that's my assumption. <laughs> How confident is he now? <laughs> <laughs> oh, oh nice. come on! Oh, this is smart. Imagine that was a great look. Here. I will say, James Bond movies always start off just big with their beginning scenes. Yep, always starting out hot. That's kind of their staple. They've always kind of done that. He's gonna do throw it at the chopper. Oh, never mind. <laughs> <laughs> guys, guys, just let me stabilize it. Then you can fight. <laughs> <Jeez>. <laughs> surprised that flare didn't do anything when it shot off on the inside oh boy that's a good way to stall it yeah. screw that <laughs> oh <laughs> see ya you got this <laughs> cool as ice damn you james and you did it again bond just enjoying you know a little sightseeing scenic view Ooh, octopus some more awesome intro music you guys won't be able to hear. It was an octopus theme for the intro, if you guys mm. didn't catch that. Mm. With all due respect, sir, it could have been worse. It blew up half a bloody block. You had no authority. We're in the middle of the biggest shakeup in the history of British intelligence. The ink's barely dry on this merger with MI5. They're itching for a chance to scrap the 00 program forever. You're right, sir. You have got a tricky day ahead. <laughs> <laughs> This is an official question. Mexico City, what were you doing there? I was taking some overdue holiday. As of this morning, you are officially grounded. I'm standing you down from all operations indefinitely. Very good, sir. I don't know what you're playing at, but whatever it is, it has to stop. 007, I'd like you to meet Max Denby, head of the Joint Security Service. Congratulations on your new appointment. Thank you. This merger's going to be a whole new chapter for us. We're going to bring British intelligence out of the dark ages into the light. That'll be all 007. Report to Q tomorrow for medical. Thank you. Very good, sir. I don't think M would yell at him like that. Yeah, no kidding. <laughs> she would have said, what the hell were you doing there? <laughs> Evening. Your delivery. Thank you. There's not one person at MI6 who isn't talking about it. That what you did in Mexico was one step too far. I think you've got a secret, and it's something you won't tell anyone, because you don't trust anyone. If what? happens to me, W7, I need you to do something. Find a man called Marco Schiara. Kill him, and don't miss the funeral. What? Where did you get it? In my mailbox, just after she died. I've been tracking Skiara ever since. When's the funeral? Three days. In Rome. Could you do a little quiet digging for me? I heard a name in Mexico, the Pale King. You want me to be your mole? And what makes you think you can trust me? Instinct. So this is just picking right up a couple days after her passing. Yeah, yeah. 
What do we got here? This is what, everything that was in the uh, Skyfall box. Yeah, you really do appreciate these movies a lot more when you watch them back to back to back. Yeah. It really helps the story quite a bit. The new Center for National Security. So that's C's new digs. What do we know about him? I read a dossier last year on how the double O program was obsolete. Went to school with the Home Secretary. Of course he did. In three days, there's a security conference in Tokyo. If C gets his way, he'll have unlimited access to intelligence streams of nine countries, including us. Q. Please excuse the mess. Now, you may feel a small Christ. <laughs> <laughs> Remember to track them again? Because they cut it out of them a while ago. Smart blood. Microchips in your bloodstream allows us to track your movements in the field. Call it a post-Mexico insurance this? policy by direct order of M. Magnificent, isn't she? Fully bulletproof. Oh, oh, wow. Oh. Been reassigned to 009. But you can have this. <laughs> Watch. Does it do anything? It tells the time. The alarm is rather loud. Will you do something for me? What do you have in mind, exactly? Make me disappear. The smart blood program is obviously still in its developmental phase, so we may experience the odd drop in coverage during the first 24 hours. 48 hours after administration, <laughs> but after that it should work perfectly. Oh, what's that? No, oh, it's just something from an admirer. It's not your birthday. No, sir. That was last week. Oh! <laughs> Whoops. Car gone! Car gone. <laughs> there we go. Oh, God. <laughs> hmm. Interesting. I'm sorry for your loss. And you're my husband? All too briefly. What do you do? Life insurance. A little late for that. For your husband, yes. But what about you? I hear the life expectancy of some widows can be very short. How can you talk like this? Can't you see him grieving? No. <laughs> <laughs> James does always put himself out there in not an awkward situation, but <laughs> to make someone else feel a little uncomfortable to maybe spill the beans a little bit. Yeah. Whoa! <laughs> Here I was thinking it was security cards. Yeah. What a lovely view. There are a hundred more that would come after me. Thanks, lad. Time for a drink. You killed him. My husband. He was an assassin. <laughs> Loyal to a man you hated. He trusted my silence. I'm gone. I'm a dead woman. Did your husband ever mention the Pale King? No. I want to go to one of these parties. It's just, I'd rather stay outside with all the nice cars. <laughs> Supercars. The budget of just that day of shooting. So this was the guy at the funeral. Don't let me interrupt you. After the success of our attacks in Hamburg and Tunisia, we reported attack in Mexico City, oh. the death of our valued colleague, Marcos Cara, leaves one of his duties Outstanding. Senor Guerra, the Pale King must be terminated. Will you make the journey to Alto Si? Por supuesto. No veremos más muestras de debilidad. He's trying to impress the big man. <laughs> he doesn't look impressed. <laughs> Take care of him. <laughs> Take care of him. Oh, who's this guy? Big he Dave. Know that I know that guy. State your credentials for succeeding Senor Guerra. What? <laughs> what the hell? <laughs> like the little metal thumbs? <laughs> Jeez. That's a hell of an intro. <laughs> <laughs> Head of the table. <laughs> Welcome, James. It's been a long time. But finally, here we are. Cuckoo. <laughs> well, this is going to be interesting. He has a whole damn building after him. Yeah. Plus Big Dave. Yep. <laughs> All right, let's test these out. <laughs> He's, oh, yeah, he said he had to get it ready for 009, right? Yep. Yeah, that he was waiting for it. It's one organization coordinating multiple attacks. I ran that check. Oh, uh, my boss had his credit card stolen. The Pale King, Quantum. Ah. Mr. White. Yep. 
First unconfirmed sighting, Altice in Austria, four months ago. Run another name, will you? A man called Franz Oberhaus. Check his files before and after his death. And I gotta say, for 007, he hasn't put a scratch on it yet, except for that little <laughs> jump on the, uh, over the top of the car. Okay, Q, give me <laughs> something. I mean, that's gotta melt the front. Okay, thank you. Yeah. Here goes nothing. What? That poor car. Based on a fine automobile. <laughs> it's time for the security services of the world to unite. Together, <laughs> for global power. We will now vote on the resolution. The vote is eight to one in favor. We cannot proceed unless by unanimous vote. Please tell me 007 is in London. I'll, um, I'll just take a look now, sir. I have him, sir. He appears to be in Chelsea. Well, I want eyes on him when I get back. Big risk. <coughs> oh, yeah, looks Austria. like you're gonna have to save the save the day, Bond, to keep your job and cues. Yep. <laughs> That's always good. Hey, I'm here with your tour dash. <laughs> oh, we got a camera in here too, huh? Do me a favor, make it quick. Upstairs, Mr. White. He is not looking good. <laughs> no, he has not aged well since we've last seen him. I was at a meeting recently, and your name came <laughs> up. Back at London, I'm still talking about me. It was Rome. Your team, not mine. I found thallium in my cell phone. I have a few weeks, maybe less. What did you do? I disobeyed him. Changed. You grew a conscience. Women, children. Tell me where he is. He's everywhere. Kissing your lover, he's eating supper with your family. Damn. Getting right in it. Uh -huh. You're protecting someone. Your daughter. You won't find her. She's clever. I can protect her if you tell me where he is. He doesn't have a real good track record with that, though. <laughs> <laughs> That's my word. America. You save her. She can lead you to America. She knows America. Try the Hoffler Clinic. Whoa, is he gonna... Wow. That's what he offered him. Mm -hmm. I mean, to, f to be fair, that was nowhere to live. No way to live the way he was... No, down in a basement, yeah. hooked oh. up to an IV drip. It's how you use the information that concerns me and who is using it. Double O program is prehistoric. Come on, Em, you can't really tell me that one man in the field can compete with all of this. But it looks like you still can't control your agents. Bond, I ran that check. Looks like oh. you've had dealings with him before. Mr. White. So maybe there's something to be said for total surveillance after all. <laughs> you just narked her out. My six yeah. agents. We watch everyone. Thinking whatever they didn't spend on dialogue, they used in uh, shots of the background. <laughs> I mean, that's a hell of a place just sitting out in the yeah. middle of nowhere on top of a mountain. My name is uh, Dr. Madeline Swan. I hope you don't mind. The view can be distracting. I hadn't noticed. <laughs> <laughs> I told you. How much alcohol do you consume? <laughs> Too much. I see you left this final question blank. What is your occupation? Well, that's not the sort of thing that looks good on a form. And why is that? I kill people. Your father's dead. Two days ago. Did you kill him? I didn't have to. He did it himself. And you came all the way just to tell me this? I came to tell you that your life is in danger and I need your help. And what was that? To find the American. You have ten minutes to leave the building. Then I'm calling security. I'll be seeing you real soon. I mean, seriously, this place is... <laughs> amazing. <laughs> amazing. <laughs> like, and James this... is back at the bar. <laughs> Franz Oberhauser is dead. And unless you come back with me right now, my career and money pennies will go the same way. But I saw him. I have a name, American. Look, I'm sorry, 007, but time's up. Do one more thing for me. Find out where you came from this. Good, he saw it. Here we go. <laughs> no escape. <laughs> <laughs> he had to put his sunglasses on. Hold on a second, That's I need my glasses. Out. Right out. All that snow. <laughs> Wait, is that James? <laughs> Where the hell did he get a plate? <laughs> How to head it up there? 
Well, that was on a lot of people's hands. Yeah, a lot of members from people we've seen already. Oh, boy. Uh, I think a little chicken action. Yeah. I don't know if that path is wide enough. <laughs> 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 Look at that pea shooter. Yeah. Oh, there you go, Q. It's looking a little tight there, Bond. Yeah. Oh. <laughs> Uh, you don't See, need you don't need wings anyways. He knew it was or only wheels. a matter of time before he lost the wings. No. <laughs> <laughs> Can I inject him? <laughs> a little questionable, but <laughs> Oh <shit. laughs> They could have been they couldn't have been Big Dave. He was in a and they first showed him he was wearing his seatbelt. Oh, don't touch me! Did it cross your mind that you led them to me? I gave your father my word. I'm your best chance of staying alive. Okay, good. Big Dave's not gone. I was just gonna <laughs> say. I walk along. They're gonna have to work a lot harder than that. I owe you an apology, 007. You are onto something. Oberhauser is still alive. The ring proves it. And it seems they were all part of one organization. Le Chief. Quantum, Skiara, your friend, Mr. Silver. Do you know who links them all? Him. This organization. Do you know what it's called? Its name is Spectre. This is so cool that everything is tied in together yep, through all the all, movies. It's all coming back. Oh, you have no. to find the American. He's our only link to Oberhauser. It's not a person. It's a place. There you go. He could have just put in Google Maps and found it. <laughs> Probably. <laughs> He's <laughs> ripping the place <laughs> apart. Well, here's to your father. I cut off all contact. And then, with his dying breath, he sends me you. The man I just met should have been dead weeks ago. The only reason his heart was still beating was you. There are two of you. <laughs> Unlucky me. He's good <laughs> <laughs> oh, oh, my God. Yes, <laughs> oh, figured it out maybe? Take her down, James. Oh, I don't know if I would have used my fist. <laughs> well, he's had it he's obviously had enough to drink. Yeah. But how is she tied in then all of it? Yeah, there's all the pictures of them. I'll make her a little more heartbroken. Oh, Vesper. Interrogation. What is it? Nothing. That's a pretty cool Easter egg there. Yeah, that's a nice callback. Yeah, I guess it'd be more of a callback yeah. than an Easter egg. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Don't grill cool. me too hard. Yeah. It is cool to show that you know James still cares for her though. Mm -hmm. My father was scanning for a particular satellite phone. He was looking for him, and he sent me here to finish the job. I'm coming with you. No, you're not. I can look after myself. That's beside the point. I might not be coming back. But I want to understand what happened to my father. Oh, I mean, it's pretty easy to understand. Your father wasn't a good dude. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Dealing with bad people. Not a long life expectancy. Yeah. They usually don't have a retirement package. Nine Eyes is now officially sanctioned. They've asked me to head the new committee, and I should tell you I've spoken with the Home Secretary. He's decided to close down the double O program with immediate effect. It's not personal. It's the future. You're a cocky little bastard, isn't you? This isn't over yet. He's got one of those punchable faces. <laughs> yeah, yes, he does. It's been a little bit. I kind of forgot that scene between those two, and it's just he keeps building every time. Supper of gin. Point <laughs> in North Africa. It registers it as empty desert. At the satellite blow up, you can clearly see this. We can't help him. He is watching everything we do. We're only handing them more information. That's true. Delete all the smart blood files. Everything. He's on his own. I see where he's coming from yeah. on that. You can't hate on it. No, mm -hmm. better to be in that situation than to have everybody knowing where he's at. So I'll have a vodka martini, dirty. Make that too. Why does a man choose the life of a paid assassin? Well, it was that or the priesthood. <laughs> Answer the question. I'm not sure I ever had a choice. You know, I think you're wrong. We always have a choice. <laughs> oh, oh, oh. <laughs> big Dave with a big punt. Uh-huh. <laughs> I don't know if hand-to-hand -hand is gonna work, James. Let's watch out for those thumbs, James. <laughs> I'm really digging this. There's no music. The fight yep. sounds great. Man, everything is breaking. <laughs> 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 That'll work. 
Oh! <laughs> there you go, you're gonna need a change. Yeah, it's gonna be something. There you go. Yeah, James. James never met anyone with this physical. No. Ever. Yo, that's a good point, Dave. You know, in a lot of the other Bonds, we've seen big hulking villains, but this is the first real wall he's come up against yeah. in this Daniel oh. Craig series. Woo! <laughs> James just got his ass beat. He's gassed out. Uh-oh. Uh -oh. Yeah. I was going to say, she had about 1.2 seconds. Yeah. Uh-oh. That's gonna have an effect. Chain him up. Shoot. <laughs> there it is. It's Big Dave's one line. Wait, that's all he. Yeah, that's, that's it all. for yeah. him. No, that's his one line of dialogue. Yeah. I have to assume that's the end of Dave. I mean, he just got taken out by his neck. <laughs> Bond didn't stand a chance, so she came in with the the pea shooter. Yep. Oh, really? That's a stop on the train line? <laughs> oh, okay. Oh, okay. Ah, oh, see? Okay. Not so smart oh, now, are ya? <laughs> What's that? In 1948, Rolls Royce saw a rain. Blues. Look at that little uh, get up there. Classic evil lair. Oh, look, look at that. that. A nice pudding green. <laughs> your host invites you both to rest. Before we show you to your rooms, just one more thing. You be careful with that. Mm. Oh, we've seen that before, haven't we? Mm -hmm. The very oh. meteorite which made this crater so many years up <laughs> there, alone, silent, huge, unstoppable force. Except it did stop, didn't it? Right here. Can't tell you how much I've been looking forward to this. A reunion, shall we? Now I'm getting the classic Bond villain feel right now. Mm -hmm. It looks like you're all alone. Not much more than a voyeur, are you? I don't think you quite understand. No, I think I do. I'm guessing our little friend C, he's one of your disciples. You could say that. You came across me so many times, and yet you never saw me. Le Chiffre, green, silver. All dead. You interfered in my world, I destroyed <laughs> yours. Or did you think it was coincidence that all the women in your life ended up dead? Vesper Lynn. She was the big one. Has he told you about her? Your beloved M. It's always been me, the author of all your pain. Smarter than me. She knows how to hide. He was everywhere. No, 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 no. Turn this off. This is important. I said, turn it off! Well, Bond didn't make him do it. Look at me. Look at him, Madeline. America. You save her. She can lead you to America. She knows America. So long. Ooh. Ouch. Ooh, right to the back of the head. Yeah, C Dub does a really great villain. Yeah. I'm going to penetrate to the inside of your head. For the first probe, we'll play with your sight, the hearing. I'll get on with it then. Nothing can be as painful as listening to you talk. Let's begin. What is that thing doing? Gee, that's uh, a drill bit? Drill. Get out of here. Why are you doing this? You probably know that James here lost his parents when he was young. It was my father who helped him through this difficult time. He taught him to ski, climb, asked me to treat him as a brother. I did not <laughs> see that coming. <laughs> you killed him. Yes, I did. This cuckoo made me realize my father's life had to end. So thank you, cuckoo. What a nut job. Franco Bowser died 20 years ago, James, in an avalanche alongside his father. The man inside your head is Ernst Stoffer Blofeld. Blofeld! If the needle finds the correct spot, you recognize no one. You won't know who she is. Another passing face on your way to the grave. He dies not knowing who you are. Ah, uh, uh, come on, Bond. I think he'd rather get hit <laughs> in the balls again. <laughs> the hell? Do those blue eyes still recognize you? I don't recognize you anywhere. What? Oh, oh James. God, not <laughs> this again. You gonna make it a minute? Oh my goodness. Doesn't time fly? 
<laughs> Out of the way! <laughs> Let's just walk blissfully while they're shooting at us. Oof. Oh, there you go. Take the four wheeler. Or the it's helicopter. A hell of a yeah. Let's go. No, I was just about to say, don't you want to finish the guy off? But there we go. Looks like yeah. a... <laughs> There's a slight gas leak in the building. Yeah. Oh, the. There's a couple vehicles driving out. We'll get in the way. Did you see that? Mm -hmm. Yeah. Two of them. I wonder if that's going to come back. Huh? I said I wonder if that's going to come back. It's safe. So what do you have for me, 007? Ernst Stavro Blofeld. And his chief of intelligence. Your new best friend, C. The system goes online at midnight. I suspect we'll have control of everything. It's good to have you back, 007. CM was confident the whole time. Yeah. James, I can't. You know, you can't what? stay here or... I can't go back to this life. I'm not going to ask you to change. You're saying goodbye. Yes. Interesting timing. Kind of find that just slightly weird out of her character to, to do it now. I don't know, I'm 50-50. I mean, I get it, but I don't. Hmm. She's in on it. Or am I wrong? Don't answer. <laughs> <laughs> just waiting for, like, a wall to drop or that to happen. <laughs> Damn, right when they get assembled, too. Yeah. Oh, so, okay, so they weren't all together. Go! Get him in the building. Yep, that's how you break zip ties, folks. Yep. It works. <laughs> all the time. <laughs> Not a good feeling being watched, is it? We're going to stop this system going online, and then I'm going to bring you in. I almost got a little call back there to... The beginning of Casino Royale, where Bond was waiting in the guy's office. You're a hard man to kill, Bluefield. This is what's left of your world. Why are we here? Did you miss me? Said, no. <laughs> <laughs> but I know someone who does. Where is she? It's for you to find out. In three minutes, this building will be demolished. Now you have a choice. Die trying to save her, or save yourself and live with the pain. I've really put you through it, haven't I? <laughs> <laughs> this is gonna be interesting to see how he pulls this shit off. Three minutes? <laughs> That's a lot of ground no to cover. Oof. Later! <laughs> Bye! Of course. Do you trust me? Do I have a choice? Not anymore. Oh, dude, I was like, what is he doing? <laughs> he put a lot of faith in that net. <laughs> yeah. Oh, but. Goodbye, James Bond. Oh, that was, that was a really cool effect. I was going to say. Yeah, yeah. Boat. Mm -hmm. yeah, we walked right past the boat. No cheering from his team? <laughs> <laughs> Nothing. They didn't even yeah, they just James, go. <laughs> just no sell. Yeah. Like, ah, oh, we knew he'd do it. Not needle. only hitting it as it's <laughs> flying away, but on a boat that's uh, like an uneven. See how smooth it's going right yeah. now, Andrew. <laughs> brace, brace, brace. Will it happen this time is the question. Nice jogging. So this is a terrorist alert. Mallory, double O section. Down them down. Was Bond gonna do like a, a wick here and <laughs> do it in front of everyone and get in trouble? Finish it. M said to do it. Out of bullet. He did that for Judy. He finally left one alive. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Even though Judy wanted the opposite. Yeah. Yep. <laughs> I've got something better to do. Anyone gonna Go arrest him? <laughs> yeah. Uh, Emma's in the background. He'll handle it. He's like 50 yards away. <laughs> Where's Blofeld going? <laughs> he did escape a massive explosion. Just Look, He's just sitting, laying there, watching. Like, I gotta see how this plays out. Oh, that's worse. Seeing Bond happy. That's what he really hates. I'm detaining you on behalf of Her Majesty's government. Good shot. What are you doing here? Good morning, Q. There's just one thing I need. Yes, sir. The original. <laughs> <laughs> I'm 
Very fitting. There you have it, folks. Spectre. All right, guys. Yeah. That was Spectre. So I have my thoughts about it, but I want to hear from you guys first. I thought it was really well done. It didn't seem like it had as much action as the previous ones. It, to me, I don't know if it was just it was drawn out a little bit more, but I love Big Dave in the role. I thought he was pretty good. Yeah. It was great keeping him silent, just let his actions do his talking for him. So I really enjoyed it. So with all that said, uh, I will give it... Ooh. Judging by the last ones, I'll give this a 415 out of 5 answers. All right. I thought it was uh, a very solid flick again here. I know in the comments everyone was kind of like they either liked it or they did not like it. <laughs> I thought it was a solid one. My nitpick of this, and I know there's probably a couple other things in here you could nitpick on, but that damn plane. <laughs> 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 and I get it, it's a movie, right? We all see these in every movie where it's just, come on, really, kind of thing. Uh, but otherwise, I thoroughly enjoyed the storytelling, and I like how it pulled from each one. Mm -hmm. And how fitting it is for Bond to leave with Mr. White's daughter. <laughs> Why not, right? All the callbacks. <laughs> and I thought it was a... a I, I shouldn't even guess anymore, because my guesses were 100. <laughs> I don't think I even got one guess right at all. Shows what I know. But uh, for my rating on here, I will actually give this a four out of five stars. I thought I thought it was very solid, so All dug right. it. And way to go, Big Dave. Yeah. And to your point earlier, you mentioned that, you know, mentioning what I said about, you know, Bond. A big imposer. big imposer, guy. like yeah. freaking Big Dave there. Yeah. That was the first time we've seen someone literally use their hands to beat the shit out of yep. Bond. So yeah. it, was, it was great to see. You did watch out for the thumbs. That's right. <laughs> no, and, and as a huge James Bond fan, guys, there was, gosh, there was so many Easter eggs and so many callbacks in this movie. You know, from uh, from Daniel Craig wearing the Dr. No suit. I mean, obviously, we have the original Aston Martin. Uh, it almost kind of felt like Dave Bautista's role. Remind me a little bit of Jaws from the original ones. Yes. You guys might know what I'm talking about. Obviously... Dave's a completely different character, but that big, hulking, imposing uh, character was excellent. And, you know, I love how it tied together, or started to tie together, no time to die, spoiler, but uh, how it started to tie together all the movies and really makes it feel like a complete story. And you really get that feeling when you watch all of them back to back like we've done. So between all the callbacks, all the little hints they throw in there for us longtime James Bond fans, I really enjoyed this movie. Uh, to your point, Answer, it didn't have the action mm -hmm. that I think uh, Skyfall or even Quantum had, quite honestly. Quantum had a lot of action in it. This was more story driven, I thought. And yes. we got a lot of that uh, from, you know, obviously the villain, Blofeld, who, as you guys know, is a huge villain in the James Bond movies, right down to the cat and the scar and everything. It was beautiful. <laughs> this was our first James Bond villain that really had, like, kind of an elaborate torture scene that we're used to seeing in some of the classic movies. So it was kind of neat to see that kind of progression in the movies and, and work its way to that. Overall, I thought it was fantastic. I loved it. I'm going to give this uh, 4.75 out of 5 answers. Interesting. I, I still prefer... Uh, Casino Royale and Skyfall over this one. Ditto. But this one is incredibly solid. Like I said, guys, if you haven't watched them, it makes for an incredibly different experience watching them all back to back, how the story ties mm -hmm. in. It was it was excellent. I think we're fortunate, as you would say sometimes with the Marvel stuff, where we force you to watch it all boom, 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 boom. Oh, where yeah. We, Andrew and I, this is our first time watching. We had the privilege to do it back to back to back. Where everything is <laughs> the fresh. The rest of us had to wait two, three <laughs> years yeah. in between movies. Yeah. yeah, see, now you felt our pain for the Marvel <laughs> yeah. ones. Yeah, these guys got to just burn right through it and get the whole story. Yep. And lucky guys. Yeah, and the good news is, is now No Time to Die will be dropping the next couple weeks. Mm -hmm. And we promise, no matter what the cost is for the rent on that, that Watch. movie will be done yep. for sure. Once again, thanks to you for watching this. So for Diamond Dave, Mason Quinn... I am of, of course, the answer. Catch you on the flippity flop. Pal. <laughs> <laughs>